Now, let me tell you this. When you're in a tough place, nobody wants to be there. We're always looking for the fastest way out, aren't we? Maybe you're in a job today that you don't like, and you consider yourself a refugee, and you're trying to get out of that, and God is saying to you, no, 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 no. I want you to be a resident. I've got a place for you, and you're not going to get where I want you to be without that. Some of you may be struggling with an illness and a sickness today, and you're wanting to get out of it as quickly as you can. And God is saying, no, 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 you keep praying. You keep trusting my healing power. But I want you to settle in and trust me in the midst of that. Some of you are in a marriage that you are acting like you're a refugee and you're wanting to bail. And God is saying to you, no, 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 you're a resident here. Trust me and watch what I'm going to do. Isn't that amazing? Because what we want to do so many times is get out as quickly as we can. And in the midst of this difficulty, here's what we learn. We learn I settle in and I trust God. And I just have to settle here and believe that he's going to do something in me instead of running. The fresh perspective here is don't be a refugee. Be a resident. Be a resident. 